guys, Teacher A here and welcome to Guru Pinoy sa Amerika. So for today, ang pag-aaralan natin ay writing linear equations in standard form which is ax plus by equals c and in slope intercept form which is y equals mx plus b. So paano ba yun? Simulan na natin. So, example number one. The given is 2y equals negative 6x plus 4. So, paano ba natin i -re -re -write itong given na to into its standard form, which is ax plus by equals c at sa slope intercept form na y equals mx plus b. So, dun muna tayo sa standard form. So, susundin lang natin to isa-isa. So, nakasunod dito, x muna, yung may x, followed by yung may y, then equals yung constant. Ibig sabihin, yung walang variable. So, dito sa given natin, based sa ating form, mauuna daw yung may x. So, therefore, si negative 6x, ililipat natin sa kabila. Kasi siya ang dapat na una. So, kapag nilipat natin to using the properties of equality, pag nilipat natin si negative 6x, magiging positive siya. So, we have 6x, and then, so, na-follow na natin yung una. Then, yung my y. So, since si 2y ay nasa left side na, therefore, hindi na siya magbabago. So, positive 2y pa rin siya. And then, equals c. Ibig sabihin, yung constant lang, yung walang letter or variable, and that is 4. So, si 4, nasa kanan na siya ng equal sign. So, hindi na rin siya magbabago. 4. So, therefore, ito ang ating standard form. 6x plus 2y equals 4. Now, paano naman natin siya i -re -re write into its slope-intercept form? So, based sa given, sabi rito, y muna equals yung may x plus b. So, yung b, ito yung ating constant. So, looking at the original given, which is 2y equals negative 6x plus 4. So, para mapunta siya sa slope-intercept form, aalisin natin yung 2 na kasama ni y. So, paano? I-divide natin each term doon sa numerical coefficient ni y, which is 2. Para ma-cancel out siya kasi 2 divided by 2 ay 1. At ang matitira ay si y lang. 1 times y ay y equals. So, negative 6 divided by 2 ay negative 3. Then, kopyahin si x. Then, 4 divided by 2 ay positive 2. So, therefore, ang ating slope, intercept form, I y equals negative 3x plus 2. So, ganun lang siya kasimple. Let's have example number 2. Okay, given 2 over 3y equals 3 fourths x minus 1. So, paano ulit natin siya i -re -re write into its standard form and slope intercept form? So, simulan natin sa standard form. Sabi rito, mauuna yung may x. So, yung may x natin, nasa kanan. Lilipat natin siya sa kaliwa. So, using the properties of equality, kapag nilipat natin siya, magma-minus 3 fourths tayo. So, transposition, i-transpose siya, magiging negative 3 over 4 x. Then, ang susunod, yung may y. So, eto yung may y, nasa kaliwa na siya. So, hindi na mag-change yung kanyang sign, positive siya. 2 over 3y and then equals so equals c yung walang variable yun ay negative 1 yan yan na bang final answer? not yet kasi may fraction tayo dapat wala tayong denominators and yung x natin dapat positive so in this case para mawala yung denominators natin i-multiply natin yung buong equation natin sa LCD so, ano ba yung LCD natin? 4 tsaka 3 yung denominators. Therefore, ang LCD natin ay 12. 12 lang ba? 
Hindi, it should be negative 12. Kasi negative yun nasa unahan para maging positive siya. So, i-multiply natin isa-isa itong nasa equation sa negative 12. Doon muna tayo sa nasa unahan. Okay? So, negative 3 times negative 12 ay positive 36 divided by 4 ay positive 9. So, 9 and then kopyahin si x. And then, pangalawa naman, we have positive 2 times negative 12 ay negative 24 Divided by 3 ay negative 8. So, we have negative 8y. Then, equals. So, si negative 1, i-multiply din kay negative 12. And that will give us positive 12. So, therefore, ang ating standard form ay 9x minus 8y equals 12. Now, paano naman natin gagawin ang ating slope-intercept form. So, eto ngayon ang ating standard form. 9x minus 8y equals 12. So, kapihin ko siya. 9x minus 8y equals 12. Para maging slope-intercept siya, malipat sa slope-intercept form, si 9x, ililipat natin sa kabila. Dapat si y lang ang nasa left side. So, maiiwan si negative 8y equals Ilipat si 9x sa kabila. Siya kasi ang una, after ng equal sign, positive 9x, nilipat, magiging negative 9x. And then, kopyahin natin si plus 12. Now, since may kasama si y na negative 8, therefore, i-divide natin lahat ng terms kay negative 8 para ma-cancel out si negative 8. Divide by negative 8. Divided by negative 8. So, makakancel out to. Ang may titira ay si y. Dali lang, walang space. Lagay ko siya sa taas. So, since nakancel out na si negative 8, bakit nakancel out? Kasi negative 8 divided by negative 8 ay 1 times y ay y. Then, equals negative 9 divided by negative 8. Hindi na natin madidivide yung mga numbers. Pero yung mga signs nila, magdi-divide natin. Negative divided by negative ay positive. So, we have positive 9 over 8x. What about si 12 tsaka si negative 8? So, positive divided by negative ay negative. Si 12 over 8 ba pwedeng i-simplify kung hindi siya pwedeng i-divide? Yes. Pwede siya i-simplify by dividing both numbers by 4. So, 12 divided by 4 ay 3. And then, over 8 divided by 4 ay 2. So, therefore, ang ating slope, intercept form ay y equals 9 over 8x minus 3 over 2. So, yan ang ating example number 2. So, kung sa tingin nyo nakatulong ang ating video sa inyong lesson na pagsusulat ng linear equations in standard form ax plus by equals c and in slope-intercept form y equals mx plus b, kung nakatulong to, kindly give me a like para i-share din to ni YouTube sa iba. So, that's it for today. See you on my next video. Paalam!